best about this land, my friend. That must be fun of its camp ahead. Cold and dirty must be the place. Throw yourself in, Gunungagap, you bastard! I am part of it! Ah, Eivor, my friend. Is Donacaster hospitality to your liking? I would be careful calling this one friend, Faravid. The crow who comes flapping when Haftan gives a whistle. Haftan and I spoke, and what of it? This is our fight, our chance for glory. Fly on home, crow. Lend me a knife, Faravid. This whelp needs gelding. Ofer, piss off. Small men always talk big. So, was Hafton generous? Did you get what you came for? If I help with your fight against the Picts, Hafton will consider me a friend. So point the way, Faravid. The Picts raided that monastery. Plundered its silver and gold. The Saxons built more churches than barns, and filled them with herds of monks. Yes, monasteries make tempting targets. And not just for us. We tracked Pictish raiders heading north. Gold is fine, but victory is our treasure. What's your plan? To open their bellies with my knife. I'm ready to fight. Let's put them in the ground. Halfdan didn't send you north to fight a skirmish we could win with half our numbers. Why are you here, Eivor? In truth, he doubts your loyalty. Fears your heart is not in this fight. Doubts my loyalty? I have fought for Hafton, killed for Hafton, bled for Hafton, and he doubts me? Nothing I have seen gives me reason to doubt you. But Hafton, he seems a cautious man. Cautious. He was always leery, but now fear has gnawed him down to the bone. To arms, dogs! Let's roast some pigs! <laughs> Watch for ambushes. Should have stayed in Donacastre. More mead, fewer picts. There's no glory in guard duty. Move out! The picts are just ahead. Lead the way and we'll watch your back. Danish topper! A smart! Keep it down or we're all dead. Masters of guile and ambush. Have a care.
Thank Thor we made it. This cave is a passage. The Pex are using it to cross the mountain. A gift for us. You track them through the cave. We'll circle around back and snare any who tried to slip away. Godly places. I should be home filling my belly. Not mucking about on the wrong side of the wall. Ah, <laughs> boil your head. We'll gang forth with our friends soon and then we'll all eat like kings. Heed my words. Wrong side of the wall. The Picts spoke of Stenway, their camp. That's to the north. Their chief may be there. Dead! Run! Stop them before they reach Stenway! They spotted us! Run forward! Faster! Faster!
must know. They'll tell the chief. Don't let them get inside. Stop them! South of the wall. Don't like it. That's the last one. Let us regroup at Stenway. We need to plan our next move. The Picts don't raid often during winter. The scouts are dead. The Picts won't know we're here. The Hornets have led us to their nest. More than a chief up there. Looks like the forward camp of an army. But would the Picts dare attack in winter? Hafton thinks not. And the Picts may use that to their advantage. Let's find out. Why would the Picts make war in winter? They must have a reason, something to gain. They will attack on sight here.
to join you, fallen! You're on the wrong side of the giant's wall, friend. Have you come to make war in winter? <laughs> Fool! He might have talked! We got what we came for. Is that more Frankish wine? I'll take a few casks. And that silver there! Ofer, that's Haftonshire. Eivor! Just in time to divide the spoils. Take some meat, if you like. The Picts are at Markness. This map spells it out. Ah, the wolf kissed is a reader. That's Dark Seder I'll never mess with. Worry about the Picts later. Now's the time for treasure and spoils. You earn it. It should be ours. We did the work. All of it. And nothing for half done. Warming his cock in a Saxon castle. Open that cask and we'll have a taste. We'll celebrate together. Sorry, friend, but that's Hafton's take. You understand. Fair enough. Hafton gets what he's owed. Fuck Hafton! If the Raven wants wine, the Raven gets wine. Open it, Faravich! If you insist, we'll all drink some stinking wine. A little sour, but not bad. I've always preferred ale myself, or spiced mead. What I won't drink is one of Moira's herbal brews. She claims they're a tonic, but there's no telling what she hides in those drinks. Moira? I met her at the feast. She's a herbalist from the north, always skulking in the shadows of Hafton's throne. It's a big throne. Don't you all skulk around it from time to time? I see. Because Hafton thinks I'm disloyal, now you don't trust me. Has our battle bond earned me no favors with you, Eivor? Doubt is too strong a word. But there is a feeling of mistrust among you. I want this alliance to be ironclad. Then let me change your mind. I've got a plan to win this war for good before the winter sets in. Magnus is a strong fort, but we'd be attacking from the south. With speed, we'll catch them off guard. With Halfton's blessing, I'd fight beside you anywhere. Name the time and place. No, Halfton is done fighting for the winter. He thinks it too great a risk. But I say we can win this war before the next snow. If we tell him of this plan, he'll refuse. But if we succeed, you and I together, he'll sing our praises all the louder. All right, we fight. But I swear by Sif's blade, I'll say nothing to Hafton. Good! Good! Victory is ours. I must return to Danacastra for a time, but I will join you for this battle. Deliver this goblet to my Jarl. He has a fondness for them. And tell him his share of the spoils is coming. When you're ready, find me near Jorvik at a place called the Waltz. Share shrinks up to each victory, like his cock, eh? 
Halfton will be waiting for his gift in Donnercaster. Do not keep him waiting. <laughs> 